we're gonna do an equine tail wrap. Uh, first thing you have, of course, is the tail and some butt wrap, or you can use brown gauze or any other bandage-like material. Um, if you're gonna use vet wrap because it does have that stretchiness to it, I unroll my roll and then just wrap it up so it's easier to lay um, onto the tail. So with the tail, um, we're gonna run our hand down and feel where the coccygeal vertebrae end. And that's kind of where uh, we're going to wrap it to, as you can kind of see in this finished uh, model. So we're just gonna kind of play with the hair a little bit. We're just gonna wrap it uh, kind of just in a folding pattern to where it is kind of in a nice little bundle and up and out of the way for repro exams, parturition, or whatever we're doing back here. Um, as far as wrapping the tail goes, I usually just start in the middle just to kind of have a securing point for all of this hair. And then directionally, doesn't really matter. You can work your way down um, and then work your way back up so we do not want any of this hair to be a part of a mess or a contaminant factor during that repro exam or live birth. And once we have it secured, that's kind of what our tail should look like. It's okay if there's a little hair coming out here, but again, I can grab and move this tail off to the side and work with whatever I need to. Boom shot.